delivered in a, in a model year. It's affecting 11 models for this platform. Where we place components, where we put things on the vehicle, we put a lot of science into that. One way we do that is through predictive 3D CAD technology, where we'll actually create three-dimensional images, put a, an imaginary person on the vehicle, and drive the vehicle through the computer, seeing what that imaginary person on the vehicle would see. So once our design is complete, we'll SLS a part to get a 3D model of it. So we'll send the file downstairs to our lab and we make an SLS part overnight. The very next day we'll have the 3D solid of what we just designed on CAD. We then have a part that we can bolt up to the motorcycle to see how it fits in space, how it looks, and its relationship with the parts around it. If a design is designed upstairs, at some point a prototype is made, that prototype finds its way down to the structures lab, and we test all kinds of structures, from as small as light bulb filaments to a fuel tank, 